Welcome to Ability Analysis, where we shall analyze all of the unlockable alternate abilities in the game before acting like a bunch of astrophysicists and pretend like we know what we're doing. Today, we shall be taking a look at the future parrot and all of its statistics and quirks. Let's get started. The future parrot is the alternate ability to the parrot pal that can only be unlocked through purchasing it from Rux. The ability functions exactly the same in causing the player to take control of a drone that assaults enemies from above. However, the future parrot comes with many changes that both enhance and hinder its performance. To start, its health is that of 20, making it able to sponge a few bullets from a handful of sources, which means you can take risks more often and likely live to Harris another day. Though following the usual rule of armored variants, this extra health does come at a price of speed, whilst its horizontal mobility isn't affected all that much, only suffering a 16.7% speed penalty going forward. Its vertical momentum suffers greatly, with a flat 25% decrease in vertical movement speed. This vertical speed penalty is what hinders its ability to dodge attacks, so you'll want to use this drone to sneak up on enemies, rather than flying right into their face. The future parrot's primary weapon, like the parrot pal, operates on an overheat system and fires at 400 rounds per minute and can fire for up to 5.4 seconds before suffering an overheat, making the weapon unavailable for the next 4.2 seconds. Each shot fired can deal 10 damage for a normal hit and 12 for a critical hit and unlike the parrot pal, does not have any form of damage drop off at all, but this does not mean that you can freely snipe people with it however. Since the future parrot's primary weapon has a permanent 2 degree dispersion angle, making it as shown here, fairly inaccurate at mid to long range. Once more suggesting the drone to be used as a surprise tool, rather than a hyper aggressive tool. The airstrike for the future parrot is also different as well. When the bird is spawned, the initial cooldown is 15 seconds. 5 seconds longer than the parrot pal, and when deploying the air strike, the pattern is of an X formation, instead of a hexagon like shape. The damage per explosion is the same, as is the impact damage, but the future parrot's air strike deploys two more explosives, and the area it affects is slightly larger, making it better suited for places of desire, such as objectives. Much like the parrot pal, the air strike has the same 30 second cooldown after its initial use, both drones have the same amount of stamina, and both drones have a 60 second cooldown. Now, to compare the two, which is better, and why? Well, the Parrot Pal's primary weapon is a lot more precise, and can fire for a much longer period of time, allowing you to constantly harass enemies for a prolonged duration. The increased overall movement speed allows you to not only play fairly aggressive, but also be extremely evasive in dodging attacks. The faster initial cooldown for the air strike also means that you can respond sooner to a group of plants. However, the primary does have damage drop off, which makes killing enemies at range quite the hassle, and a small amount of health means that any stray bullet will kill you instantly. On the other hand, the future parrot's health pool of 20 allows you to sponge certain attacks without getting destroyed, and its more powerful primary, both in having more damage and having a faster rate of fire, allow you to mow down enemies relatively quickly. Its air strike is more powerful, and on top of that, covers a slightly larger area as well, making it particularly efficient at clearing out objectives. However, its primary is very inaccurate, making long-range combat unreliable, and the immense reduction in movement speed does make dodging attacks and aggressive plays much more risky and unreliable, and the slightly longer initial cooldown for air strike does make it slightly less responsive in short-term situations. Both drones consume stamina at the same rate, and both have the same cooldown once destroyed. So, with the comparisons out of the way, which is better at what? Well, if you're wanting a drone that is highly mobile, has an accurate weapon useful at all ranges, great at aggressive plays, and an airstrike that respond quickly when summoning the drone, then the Parrot Pal is your go-to option. If however, you're wanting a drone that can tank several shots, have a more powerful primary at mid to close range, a more powerful airstrike that covers a slightly larger radius, and don't mind sacrificing a sizable portion of your mobility, then the future parrot is your go-to option. As for my final verdict across all scenarios and capabilities, I would have to go with the future parrot, for not only is its health a saving grace in sponging stray bullets, but the more powerful primary and airstrike are more than 
than worth sacrificing a bit of speed for. Be sure to come back for the next episode in 2 weeks. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more shit like this. Have fun.